Mike Singer. Hey, Nicola, uh, what happened in that final minute? Uh, Malone just said six turnovers over the final two minutes and 40 seconds to nearly give them the game. I mean, it was terrible. Uh, we turned the ball over a couple of times. Uh, they had easy points. They made a couple of tough, tough shots. Mbletz made a, over the backboard and Ingo made a really tough shot. But, I mean, they were playing hard. Uh, the basketball gods always give a little bit of luck to the, the, the people who is playing hard. Brandon Crystal. When you talk about basketball luck, I guess I got two for you. Uh, the block on Zion, was that just great D? You knew that all the way you'd have no, no problem blocking his shot. And then secondly, uh, I'm half kidding, obviously. Coach said he thinks you're pretty tired just because all the minutes. Do you feel that? Is that accurate from Coach? I mean, um, well, I've been being tired in this part of the year. I think it's it's normal. If if nobody start, if someone is not tired, it's not good. I mean, something something's wrong. You know, he's a superhuman. I think. But yeah, um, the last block, uh, Ingram was driving to the middle. I was there to stop, stop the stop the uh, stop the block or uh, stop the drive. He he passed a little like shuffle pass. To Zion, he went to dunk, and I was I was just going to, I was going hard uh, just to not let him score. You know, uh, I was I was aiming for the ball, and I was going uh, as hard as as I can. If if, if um, even if they if, if it's a foul, so don't don't give him and one. Zachary Cram. Hi, obviously you came up with that big defensive play at the end of the game tonight, but when looking in general this season, different metrics say different things about your defense. Some say you've been amazing. Some say you've just been average. I'm curious if you pay any attention to these defensive numbers and in general, how would you assess your defensive performance overall this season? Uh, I think I'm in the middle. Uh, I think I'm not a great defender. I'm not, I'm not the worst defender. I think I'm um, you know, I can, I can, I can make a, a couple stops. I can say sometimes I can't. You know, so mm, depends. I, I think I'm right there in the middle. Uh, I'm just, I'm just trying to get better. You know, to, to be, uh, to be really good in both of the, or both part of the floors, both end of the floors, court, or however you say. Leonardo Torres. Hi, Nicola. It's Leonardo Torres from Peru. Congrats on the win. Nicola, you guys grabbed less rebounds, had less assists, and just 31.3% of three points. What was the key to win tonight? I don't know, to be honest. Uh, I mean, uh, I, I think we had a couple of steals. We, we, we were, we, uh, especially in the first half, I think we get a lot of opportunity to run and score in transition. Um, we were getting open shots. I think uh, we, didn't, we didn't we didn't make it, but I think uh, when when we needed to, to score, when we scored. I always say that when, I think in NBA is the most important when you need to score or when you need to stop uh, to have a stop, make a stop. You make a stop. You know, so that's how you win the game. Especially in the close game like this, it's not supposed to be close, but it it's close. It was close, so hopefully, hopefully, we're gonna be much better than this this last two minutes. Alexander Zikic. Nikola, čestitam na pobedi tvoja trije stva poena. Evo malo ću se i na engleskom dosta tome priča. Kad je proći rutina, izgledalo da će igrali ste tako snažno, velika razlika, da će to biti jedna laka pobjeda skoro, ali pred sam kraj bilo je stvari neizvesno. Pa da, to bilo je baš nepotrebno neizvesno. Imali smo šest izgubnih lopti u zadnje dva minuta. Ja ne znam, svojno mislim da je to neki rekord 100%. Ovaj, nismo se sporozumeli, totalno je bilo neka loša, loša komunikacija, energija na terenu, nekako svi smo, ne znam ja šta, možda napadali jedne druge bez nekog razloga, ali da, ovo je najvažnije da smo pobedili, ovaj, u prvom pomeru mislim da smo igrali baš jako dobro, kao što si rekao, 
Ovaj, u drugom podvremenu i isto do, do treće četvrtine četvrta smo malo loše, lošije počeli gde su oni napravili neku seriju 8-0 ili tako nešto ili 10-2 isti djavo ovaj, gde su se kako da kažem uključili u, uključili u tekmicu i onda je dok samo po kraju bilo neizvesno gde sam mi opet otešli na nekih 10 ili 9 po jedne razlike Eto, na kraju kažemo opet i dve, uh, sedam, šest izgubljenih fakti dva zadnja dva minuta što je stvarno ovaj, baš loše. Esteban Abed. Hi Nicola, congrats for the win from Cordoba, Argentina. Thank I you. have uh, two questions for you. Uh, first one, uh, what can you tell me about the the job of a uh, backward uh, work, sorry, for the um for a uh, rebounding okay uh -huh. uh, against our offensive uh, leader in this case uh, new orleans and about faku seeing him make the crucial three points in the last minute yeah i mean uh rebounding is um i mean demis uh, steve uh adams who is uh of course um, like is he the best rebound offensive rebounder in the game so I think he's if it's not there, he's up there. So uh, with Zion, uh, with, with, with Lonzo, I think just with the guys who are kind of they can surprise you, you know, um, they, they, they never quit. But uh, I think uh, I don't know, I know we just needed to, they didn't have that much offensive rebounds, but sometimes they would just uh, make make mistake, you know. And about Faku, yeah, he was he was really good. Um, he was op shooting the open wide shots, um, and he needs to shoot it. You know, sometimes maybe I think he thinks that he's a point guard. He needs to pass or whatever. When you open, you gotta shoot it because that's the best shot we, we have on the floor. I think he had one in the corner that he was um, he missed, and then it was a really good shot. All right, Nicole, we got time for one more. We're gonna end with Joel Rush. Mm -hmm. Hey, Nicola. Uh, after losing Jamal and Monte and Will, there was a lot of uncertainty about what might happen with you guys, but how impressed are you at how the uh, reserve backcourt has just stepped up in their absence? I mean, we cannot think about it, to be honest. Uh, it's, uh, it's, um, it is what it is, you know. We, we can just fight and uh, hopefully to win as much of the game as possible. We are amazing guys, of course. They're they're the big, uh, big, big part of of our uh, basketball. Mm, but it, you know, we are we are waiting for them to come back. But uh, in that time, we I think the players have the opportunity to 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 play, and they are playing good. You know, uh, hopefully, hopefully we can continue to play like this. All right, that'll do it. Thank you, Nicola. My pleasure, guys. Like always.